most common symptoms include renal angle pain, vomitings, sometimes with the urinary tract infection in which there is burning maturation, painful urination or there is increased frequency of urination. Patient may have a sudden bout of renal angle pain which is very unbearable. Risk factors or the causes of renal stone may include family history, there are hereditary factors, there may be high intake of proteins, there may be high intake of calcium, there may be altered metabolism of proteins which can lead to stone formation. Risk factors also include less intake of liquids or water. Because of that, the products of protein metabolism get stuck in the kidney itself and not flushed out with the urine. So there may be formation of stone in the kidney. Renal stones ki bahut sari complications ho sakti hai. For example, if the renal stone is getting stuck in the renal pelvis, that may create a back pressure of the urine that is called as hydronephrosis. Hydronephrosis may be of many types, it may be mild, moderate or severe. In severe cases, there is swelling of the kidney and it may lead to renal failure as well. Renal stones may cause repetitive recurrent urinary tract infections. Renal stone may cause obstructive nephropathy. If the renal stone gets stuck in the ureter, it may lead to a condition of hydroureter. So regarding the treatment part, chote stones up to 5 mm, they pass easily without any medication just by increasing the intake of liquids or water in your diet. For bigger stones, in conventional system, there are many methods. There is lithotripsy in which there is a laser technique to crush the stones and then a stent is passed to pass those stones out of the urinary tract. Homeopathy has a great solution for renal stones. We have many medications which are available for crushing of the stone and easy passage of the stone. Many a times we prescribe those kind of medication to the patient and patient comes with the stone in hand. Dr. Saab, ye nikal gaya. And that's the happiest moment for us.